Here is a mesh exporter for Blender 2.59, 2.60 and 2.61. It works for weighted meshes, and it also supports joints offsets. You can find the add-on at the Machini Matrix website. I show you now how to install it, and how to use it. First, get the file from the distribution page, and place it somewhere on your local disk. Take care that your file path does not contain any special characters, otherwise Blender will not install the module. Next open Blender, and proceed to the user preferences. Then navigate to the add-on tag. Now press the button, install add-on, and then locate the file on your disk. Now you can open the module description. Here you find a link to the product page, another link to our issue tracker, and a button for complete remove of the tool. So, we activate the module by checking the check mark in the upper right corner. And in order to make your settings permanent, finally save as default. Now I open the Avatar Workbench for a quick demo. Actually you can open any of your own blend files. That should work for you too. I check the orientation of the character. I can do this by going to front view. Now the character looks to the right side, and this is the orientation needed by Second Life. Now let us export the character. I keep an object mode, and select all parts of the mesh. Then I proceed to, File, Export, SL Colada. I navigate to my destination folder, and select a convenient name for my file. Now we have to tell the exporter about the orientation of our character. Remember, our character orientation is already compatible to SL. So we do not need to fix the rotation. Hence we have to uncheck the rotation check mark in the lower left corner of the export panel, and finally press the export button. If you work with joints offsets, then you also have to export the armature along with your mesh parts. And again, we have to remember about the character orientation, and disable that corresponding check mark before exporting. But there is still another option available. You now can decide to use the Blender orientation. That is, when the character looks towards the screen while you work in front view. This orientation enables you to use the symmetry tools for easier weighting. Just select the armature and rotate it by minus 90 degrees along the Z-axis. Finally apply rotation, otherwise the exporter will not accept your request. Now proceed as before. Export just your mesh parts, or add the armature for the modified joints. And now keep the rotation check mark in the exporter untouched. Simply export, and you are done. All just exported meshes can later be successfully imported into Second Life. But you should be prepared that the Second Life importer sometimes crashes without any recognizable reason. But so far, in all cases the import worked for me again, right after restarting the viewer. I hope that the SL Galata exporter will become a useful tool for you. And I also hope that we will be able to fix Blender itself soon, so that this tool will eventually become obsolete again. Thank you for watching.